Sifuna, when we sit separately, he knows how the election was lost. So Sifuna, even when you cry, you... How was it? I know, so, it was stolen. No. Yeah, come on. No, 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 no. <laughs> why was yours not stolen? I, mine was no. not stolen. No, why was yours not stolen? <laughs> because it, it is not as, as, as consequential. No, no, no. no. Now, how was it, it lost? Yeah. Yeah. It is. How was it? How was it lost? Eh? Now that you say you people know. <clears throat> How it how was lost. Yeah. They mismanaged their campaigns. Okay. No. Yeah. They never they never even protected their vote. In fact, they, they did see, not even have agents. Okay. You see, if we, if, yeah, if, we're if we're that, let's, let's, we'll, let's, but let's not go there. Yeah, let's, let's not go there. But, but let's, 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 let's no 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 no. <laughs> yeah, let me just ask you one question. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we know. Yeah. Why is there a need to protect votes? From what? Why do we need? Why do, does anyone need to protect votes? Why do you need a server? No, that, I'm no, just no, no. asking My you. My question is: Why do you need why, to protect why if, votes? Fine. Oh, why, do we, vote? why do we have a server? No, a server is just a technological that, advantage yeah, to collect is results. Is it for protection? No, that's what I'm asking no, you. No, no, no. Is it for protection? It's not for protection. Yeah. I'm asking you: Why, in an electoral I, I, system, I, I, that I want, is I want to, to be unfair? Yeah. Why do I need agents? What? Why? Why do I need agents in an election? Why? 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 Why is it in our process? We need to take. Uh, records. I think his point is, if it was uh, right and credible, you would not need to have some. Why do you, ha why do you have a watchman? Correct. In your house. Because they are thieves. Yeah? Th because they are thieves. Yes. Yes. And, you and electoral them? thieves. And if and you are not vigilant, they end up in the place that you are. That's what we are saying. You are thieves. Let, you stole let, the election. No, no, But the no, Supreme no, no. Court disagrees with that. Your party this did not even lawyer, carry out no. nomination. Let's, let's what you, no, 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 Goja. No, Goja, excuse me. I was with him. Yeah. Hello, Alex. His party Alex, 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 did not even carry out yeah. nomination. What do you okay. mean? I'm the SG of ODM. We carried out nomination. Right. Where? We are I was a candidate. I was a candidate. You lost the nomination. I did not. Hello, Ale. We were talking about... And you know what you did. Oh, you know we are deviating from the conversation. No, we are not deviating. Let him just be told... The possible... Excuse me. Let him... Let him accept yeah, defeat. Now. The election was not stolen. He won his. <laughs> that was settled by the Supreme Court. Yes. Alwale, so, you're talking about an yes. economic <laughs> stimulus package. Nobody, <clears throat> no Kenyan hates Right Honorable Raila Molo Odinga. He's loved for what he's done before. The only problem is refusing to accept defeat. And he knows why he didn't win. You know, <laughs> me, uh, Sifuna is his friend and their family friend. Me is my brother. I can't change it. Not even brother by being a Luo. We share a great grandfather. Oh. Are you getting he's me? He's your relative. Yes, he's my relative. <laughs> okay. eh? And it's a fact. He yeah. cannot come here and deny it. We, no, share, we share the same DNA, yeah. and, and we don't hate him. Yeah. We love him so much. And we take, we, what we need to do is to unite this country. Where do we go from here now? Kenyans are saying we are suffering now. The reality is, ah, the cost of fuel has gone up. What is being done? That is what everybody keeps asking wherever we go. Stop with all the blame games. What is being done? We are in a bad place. Not as a, a government or as a nation. But today, the entire world is faced with economic recession. Many reasons, but the most <coughs> challenging was the two years when the world stopped working, thanks to COVID-19. Yeah. Kalwale, it is a fact that uh, 79 shillings uh, out of every liter of petrol in this country is tax. It is tax because it is itemized, and you can tell that this is the percentage that is going to uh, fuel levy, this is a percentage that is going to VAT. I gave you the example that uh, the 8% uh, increase that we added on, on the VAT for fuel is responsible for 14 shillings. Now, it is just a matter of uh, math. If you have added 8% and it is resulting in an increase of 14 shillings, if you take away 8%, it should take away 14 shillings. We have argued with you that because of the uh, economic situation in the country, we in our uh, uh, own view, uh, did not support uh, the imposition of extra taxation on Kenyans uh, at this point in time because we need for the economy to recover, we need for people's pockets to recover. And it is having a negative effect. Uh, you have seen reports of uh, major uh, global conglomerates who operate in this country, uh, manufacturers, uh, shedding uh, you know, jobs. You have had it. You have had a reduction of taxes because Kenyans are consuming less. Even the petrol, it has had the uh, opposite effect. The revenues that were expected to be raised by government are not being realized. It is also not true that uh, uh, the current regime is not borrowing to finance recurrent expenditure. Uh, the control of budget told us the other day that in the period between April and June, 
government debt grew by 860 billion. Essentially, we are fully saying 10 billion shillings a day. That is not me. That is the control of budget. We have also been told, uh, Trevor, that because of the cost of living, the margin of increase in, in the cost of living, yeah. uh, the cost of uh, produce and the cost of goods, there has been a 24% increase on the cost of hospitality, the money that is spent by government on bashes and, and, and travel and entertaining. And you would not be surprised that the number one government entity spending at least 2.3 billion shillings on hospitality is the office of a president. So let, let these people not tell us many stories. The very clear uh, solution to this problem is known. First of all, we all need to tighten our belts. You cannot be asking Wanjiku, you cannot be asking Mamamboga and Boda Boda to tighten their belts, yet your belt, you have even removed it and thrown it away. <laughs> you are spending 2.3 billion shillings. I, I gave you the example last time we were here. The office of the deputy president put out an advertisement for seafood, supply of seafood. What does Gashagwa know about seafood? Uwe ni mutu wa mutura, anatafuta sifu ya nini and it is at the expense of our, uh, our taxpayers' money. You should cut that spending first before you tell Kenyans to tighten their belts, you know? So the, the problems are known, the solutions are known. We asked for a reprieve, we even told them that uh, because Kenyans are suffering, please reinstate that uh, subsidy. Yeah. At some point, they tried to reinstate it. They reinstated it in part. Yeah. Then they called it something else, UFU fuel stabilization. Because these people, they, they fear. They fear doing the right thing because they say Sifuna and the, the opposition will take credit. Yeah. That is not our intention. Our intention is not to say, oh, we were right and you were wrong. Please, just solve the Mwanainchi problems. Let the country move on so that we can discuss other things. Uh, you know, Kenya Power used to send us an item as bill yeah. where you could see each and every tax that is, is going uh, 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 was coming from your pocket. Mm. And when the Senate began that inquiry, they changed the way in which they send you the bill. If you buy uh, purchase tokens of 100 shillings now, they will not tell you what the fuel cost charge is. Yeah. They're trying to hide uh, these things within other things so that the representatives of the people don't focus on them. So my bill is trying to address three things. Yeah. There's something called a capacity charge that we pay for the capacity, whether that, uh, the, the capacity of the generating plant, whether that plant is actually selling electricity to Kenya Power or not. And to address that, we have said Kenya Power should not give any more power purchase agreements until the need for that new capacity is established, number one. Number <coughs> something called fuel cost charge. Mm. The fuel cost charge makes up to, uh, if you buy tokens of 100 shillings, 24 shillings is for fuel cost adjustment, and that is uh, as a result of all the electricity that is consumed that is generated using thermal sources. Yeah. So we need to grow our uh, green energy sources and we have said, uh, proposed in that bill because we have capacity of cheaper green uh, sources of electricity. Yeah. That person who's called the dispatcher at Kenya Power should give priority to cheaper, greener electricity before uh, dispatching what they call uh, the thermal sources of, uh, of electricity. Mm -hmm. uh, and finally, we deal with the question of forex fluctuation by also addressing the question of uh, the denomination of uh, the loans that are used yeah. uh, to construct these power plants in foreign uh, currency. So, okay. Uh, or, uh, Charles, what do you think uh, of the immediate intervention measures? No, first first of all, I want to congratulate Sifuna. Yeah. Because now he speaks like somebody who went to the school where Dr. Halwale went. <laughs> <laughs> because, <We know. laughs> yes, because uh, that is what is expected yeah. of a man of his caliber yeah. and age who has a lot of future with him. <clears throat> because we expect them to discuss some of these problems within uh, uh, the legislative frames that they have, yeah. either in Senate or in Parliament. I'm proud when I hear that as a member of the Energy uh, Committee, he's involved in looking at solutions yeah. to some of these problems and not carrying Sufuria, wasting time in the street and lying to Point of order. I'm sorry. Point of order. So, 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 <laughs> so <laughs> yeah, I also agree with him on the point of order yeah. because that also supports the ego yeah. of the people who uh, voted him, yeah. whom he said they must cry together, at least so that uh, they get some solace. Uh, this government came into place and found the treasury was completely robbed. There was virtually nothing. Mm -hmm. And uh, that we had very huge debts. That meant that if we could not pay our debts, we could not service our debts, then, they, then our economy was going to be insolvent.